today guys we're going to be doing a five combo abdominal series yes with active recovery this workout is going to be a mix of high intensity intervals with abdominal work all right we're going to be working the lower the upper the middle pretty much the entire abdominal region as a whole are you ready to rock and roll with beat the gym all right well you know i am let's get it in this five combo series, the first combo is gonna be the plank abdominal core blast, all right? This is gonna require you to get into a full plank. From there, you're gonna open your legs up twice, very ballistically. Then you're gonna take that knee, drive it to the elbow. Take the opposing knee, drive it to the elbow. Take the next knee, take it up under. You're gonna work those obliques as you drive that knee underneath, all right? You're gonna switch and do it to the other side and repeat. We're gonna knock this out for five times all the way through and take a break. All right, so for combo two, we're gonna be doing the lower abdominal plaster, all right? This is gonna require you to lay back, get those legs off the ground. From here, you're gonna give me an up and a down. And when you get down, you're gonna hold it six inches off the ground, we're gonna flutter. One, two, three, four, open, close, open, close, all right? And then we're gonna repeat. Up, down, flutter, flutter, open, close, open, close on each one, getting those lower abdominals fired up. All right, guys, for combo number three, we're doing the oblique enhancer. This is guaranteed to shrink that waistline, all right? So it's a reach, reach, one, two, three, four. You're gonna punch your way into that smaller dress size, all right? So you're gonna reach, try to over-exaggerate on the twist, all right? Then when you do your punches, you're gonna give me four. Boom, 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 boom. Contracting those oblique muscles and shrinking that waistline. All right, for the fourth combo, guys, it's called static eccentrics, all right? We're gonna work the static control by holding at the top, and we're gonna come down under control for four seconds. Three, two, one, up, hold it at the top, squeeze, make that muscle, try to bring that belly button in, and down, two, three, four. Squeeze and hold, lock it. Make sure that you're holding that contraction, and this is how you work that inner abdominal. For combo number five, we got TA holes. That's transverse abdominal holes, all right? We're gonna start off in a side plank. You're gonna get on your elbows, all right? Keeping your hips engaged, keeping your abdominals engaged. You're gonna drop it down. Bring the hips all the way down. You're gonna bring it up, you're gonna squeeze. You're gonna give me a hold, all right? I want you to give me a hold for one second. Then you're gonna release, bring it down, get close to the ground, but not touching. Coming back up, squeezing, engaging those abs, all right? This is how you work that inner abdominal. So your work does not end at just the combos. Remember, you're gonna be knocking out each combo for five repetitions and for three rounds. 
In between each combo, I want you to do some active recovery. Yes, guys, Rick's gonna work the entire abdominal region. It's gonna keep your heart rate going, okay? You're gonna have your hands by your head. You're gonna work the obliques, bring it back, keep that belly button as close to the spine as possible, tucking it in, squeeze and turn, and we're gonna work it on a cadence. We're gonna knock it out. We're gonna knock out 20, all right? Can it count? One, two, for 20 repetitions, and you're gonna get back down and attack the next combo, progressive. All right, guys, remember, big things are accomplished through the perfections of minor details. Let's get it done today.